morning everyone welcome back to the channel i just want to say thank you so much for your support and love throughout my last um, couple of videos if you can just please um subscribe to the channel you know leave um, some comment below uh, let me know what you think about the videos and you know smash that like button um, that would be really really appreciated now um in some i'm actually driving something pretty interesting today all right so as you can see at the title maybe i'm trading my ek9 type R for this car here so i'll give you a little hint it's got four doors it's got six cylinders turbo charge and it's manual um it's super super comfy to drive it's got you know leather seat there are, there are electric seats as well, you know, aircon, heaters, actually works. So, and it's really, really well known in the, I would say, drifting community too. So, can you guess what it is? Let's find out, I'll show you in a minute. impression of driving this car is very I would say nimble to drive it's very uh, forgiving very friendly to drive it's not it's not that it's not uh, it's not too aggressive to drive so maybe because the car um, is sort of stock so that's why it's pretty easy to drive um, personally I, I do prefer the JZX100 shape um, over this um, this one just looks a little bit more round I do prefer the JZX100, but this still look really cool. Um, I reckon with a nice set of wheels like those, or even three-piece uh, workmeister um, with a nice body kit on it, they are pretty cool. This is a factory front bar with a factory front lip. It might be aftermarket front lip though. Um, let me know in the comment below what lip you think that is, if you know um, about your chases. And they got a side skirt as well. Um, again, I don't know, it could be a vertex side skirt or um, factory. And then it's got a rear lip as well. So it's really, with, with chases, in my opinion, you know, without the um, front lip side skirt and re rear lips, they, they look a bit empty, right? But they look a lot li a lot more fatter with, with the, in the, the full body kit on. Still got the key. It's a 35th anniversary. I don't know if you can see in the camera, but I'm not. Um, correct me if I'm wrong, guys, but because I'm not really um, familiar with chases, especially the Mark II. But wow, they're actually pretty clean. The Almighty 1JZ Turbo. And just so you know guys, this car actually available for purchase as well. So if you're interested in this car, just hit up Joe from Cars from Japan. Uh, I'm pretty sure he got a few more as well. But I really miss my 1J, um, JZX100 now. Wow. You don't need much to uh, have fun with these cars to be honest. Um, we, I think you can make uh, com comfortably 300 kilowatts which is um, um, I would say just minor mods to it what is up guy um, I'm finally home 
Um, so after I test drive um, the JZX 110 Mark II, um, it's, got, it's really got me thinking about actually building a drift car for the channel. So um, I'm really I'm, I'm thinking about it. Um, that would be fun. I want this ch um, channel to be more because you know with YouTube, right? A lot of people have done. It's, it's hard to really be creative and do something new because most most everything ha has been done already. So my main goal is just basically just to have fun and get everything docu documented and have fun. Um, I think that's the main goal. Um, it's not about competing with anyone. It's all about having fun and just um, be able to share it to you guys. So, um, once again, thank you so much for your support. Um, please, you know, hit that subscribe button and the like button, and let me know in the comment below what car you want to see next. Other than that, I will see you in the next video.